Morning guys, how are we? I'm Mark from Treasure Hunt in Scotland and today we're in the middle of Salt Market Street and we're going to be visiting one of Glasgow's oldest steeples and it's just here and I'll take you up, show you right at the heart of Merchant City I'll just take you out and we'll show you this steeple and this is Glasgow's oldest steeple, 1625 to 26 and it's a toll steeple it was built, it was part of the old jail none of the jail is left anymore, it was a uh, demolished and moved to Salt Market Street but this is also Glasgow's oldest hanging tower at 1625 to 26 this is where they hang people uh, in Scotland and Glasgow's oldest tower so we're just going to go for a wee tour about here we've got another structure over here which looks to be part of it it's a unicorn on that as well so you guys are picking this up okay we're just going to go for a wee tour around Glasgow today Look at some of the old structures and towers. Check this one out over here as well. Part of a really old building there. Love it, love the history down here. So this is 1625 to 26. It was Glasgow's oldest tower. It's a hanging tower. Used to be able to walk along uh, Salt Market Street where they moved it to just along by the city chambers. And there used to be rocks on the ground. It used to say such and such was hanged here in such and such a date. Or this is where the Glasgow's oldest jail was or where they hang people because they didn't just hang people here they also hang people in the old jail as well up to the early 1900s so we're just going to go for a little look about Glasgow show you some of the old structures and, and enlighten you and some history so that's what I'm going to do today and this is where we're starting Glasgow Build Tower and I'll catch you at the next venue so guys here's a bit of architecture up above a shop and it's a, a man. I'm always like a female wear a bat suit. <laughs> but it's some great architecture. It's, it's just class in Glasgow. This is where you find some of Glasgow's oldest characters. This is a toll booth bar, big press there. And we'll just go for a wee walk about. I think we'll head up towards the Barrowlands and up High Street and see what else we can see. This is obviously part of the old jail as well. You can see, look at that, look at the old locks. Magnificent, isn't it? Knock, knock. <laughs> Says Nemo Me MP201. That's it. It's like a big crest. Scottish crest. Beautiful, isn't it? And there's another Scottish crest just up here. There's a unicorn round here as well. Just take a wee look round and have a look, but you can see that unicorn up there. Big unicorn. We'll get around this way, this way will be where you see it. There you go, big unicorn. This is one of Glasgow's oldest bridges, check that out, the big person with the crown on. I wonder what king or queen that is. Looks like George, this is one of Glasgow's oldest bridges. Over there, you can see where the, the rescue is. That's a rescue for the Clyde over there, and part of that is to do with dredging the Clyde as well. But this is one of Glasgow's oldest bridges. You see the boat and crest, and the bridge is absolutely magnificent in structure. At a central station. Check their buildings out, they're just absolutely magnificent, aren't they? Attached to an old railway bridge. Just along there, of course, was the Clifford tragedy as well. For anybody who doesn't know where that was, it was a helicopter that ran out of fuel and landed on top of a pub and killed quite a lot of people, which is a shame. So like I was saying, Glasgow's oldest bridge is over here. The city of Glasgow College is over there. This is Glasgow's High Court. This is where you get convicted. And of course, down there is a the steeple in Glasgow Green. So we're just going to go for a little tour along this way and just see what else, what other sights we've got to see in Glasgow. Check this big clock out, we're on Blythewood Street. I found this big clock, that's absolutely magnificent. Some of the structures here. And we're, we're heading towards Central Station, I'm just going to put money in the old car park meters. Look how much it is, 60 pence for 12 minutes. And a two hour maximum stay, ridiculous. So we're heading along to Central Station now. And uh, I'll catch you there. Guys, yeah, just along here. You can see parts of Cardogan Street and that's parts of the old remnants of Victorian Glasgow. There you go, big steeples, some lovely architecture. For an old Glasgow structure, eh? 
says William Whitley Warehouses. That must be old, eh? On another street. The GTW Warehouses, Uncle William tells stories about places like this. He used to work for the storage company, pumping stuff up and down stairs. It's amazing the memories that come back to you when you see places like this. There you go, lovely building, William Whitley Warehouse. Over there, I think it's Glasgow's MOD building, and that's just the back of where Whitley's was, where I was a minute ago. But that's the MOD building, we're going to head out onto the Clyde over here to look at some of these structural, architectural designs and some of the bridges, and we'll just have a look, check that out, some of the bridges. We'll just get over there and I'll start filming again. We're down on the riverfront, this is a riverboat here which holds many concerts, and uh, basically this river has had so many people go in it in the last year that they thought there was a serial killer in Glasgow because so many people have drowned in here in the last year and um, this is a new bridge that goes across just further past the you can see Glasgow's uh, central station bridge, the trains there just past there is where the old docks, Glasgow docks used to be used to be on Kingston Street, just off Kingston Street that's where my granny and granda came from over there you can see that big structural mess with a sinkhole which I'm possible, possible, possible well, I'm more than sure <laughs> that was a sinkhole that I gathered up and uh, maybe one day we'll go over there magnet fishing over here is another one of Glasgow's structural designs and basically there's a, the old M8 as well bridge this high on a dangerous river like this. Check that out, check the stupidity of that. Unbelievable. Guys, here we are, this is another old bridge at Glasgow. It's at Central Station, you can see Central Station Bridge just up above it. And uh, basically under Central Station it's got an underground city which goes back to I think the early 1600s or 1500s, it's medieval anyway. Uh, there's, a, there's actually an old platform as well underneath Central Station. I think they do ghost tours now on that, I mean I could be 100% wrong on that but uh, I'm worried for these kids safety along here, they keep climbing the bridge but uh, we'll head along this way where we're standing just now, at one point this would have been full of Glasgow shipyards I mean look at the old, all the way along this would have been a jolly Glasgow shipyard over there is Kingston Street, Kingston Street was basically a community destroyed just for a motorway that's, in my view, what Kingston Street was. Everybody knows it. It was one of the best cities. Um, and even my granny and granda used to say that. It was one of the best places ever to stay was Kingston Street. I actually thought the, the, the central station was medieval, but it's actually a Victorian village and you can do the tour for £10. So maybe one day we'll pay the £10 and we'll go and do the tour. Just look at that across here. It's magnificent. I love this place, you can just walk about Glasgow all day and film stuff because there's just so much history, so much of it. And I'm on another street at the Royal Casino, look at the architecture on this building, I'll take some pictures in case my camera doesn't pick it up. But we've got crests, we've got horse riders with big spears and forks and everything, check that out. Wow, what a lovely building, some lovely architectural design was put out of this building, amazing, look at that! With architectural design in this building, it's got boats coming out of it with anchors, look up here, wow, fantastic, what an amazing building with some ma amazing architectural design, wow, absolutely lovely. Dale Street we're on, this is where Central Station is along, just along here you can see the platform, that's a platform entry to Central Station. And do you know she looks better with a can of iron brew and some Glasgow structures behind her, she's had a nice face paint as well, <laughs> brilliant, love it, gotta love it.